What we're looking at here are floor trusses. These are trusses, not joists. People often confuse the two. Now these here are top bearing trusses because they're gonna bear on the top cord. These up here are also top bearing, just a different style. And that right there where my hand is, that's where the truss is gonna bear. Trusses come in all different configurations. These here are bottom bearing, which means they're gonna bear on the bottom cord where my finger was. And that notch in the top is for a continuous two by four. Now truss plans might seem confusing at first, but they're actually really easy because everything is labeled. These trusses here are D104s, these are C105s, and if we go and look at the actual trusses, they're all labeled. See, these are C104s. So you really can't mix it up. It's just kind of like a big puzzle. And it'll show you where any beams go, and it'll even tell you where hangers are needed and what type of hangers are needed. Now, some people don't like trusses, but there are a lot of advantages to them. They're simple to install, and it makes it really easy to run any kind of electrical, plumbing, sprinklers, HVAC, anything through them, because you don't have to make holes, because they're already there. And really, as long as they're secured, 